Welcome to Basic.net video e-learning program. In this video, we will discuss how to disable the administrator shares creation in Windows NT, Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows 2003 machines. Every Windows machine automatically creates a share for each side on the system. These shares are hidden but available with the full control to the main administrators. The drive letter followed by the dollar sign is the name and it is shared from the root. When trying to attain a highly skilled network, you may wish to address this potential security issue by disabling these shares or at least restricting their permissions to specific users or services. It is possible to simply remove the share from server manager in NT or share folders in Windows 2000, Windows XP, Windows 2003. But the problem with the method is that the share will automatically be recreated when the machine reboots. You can disable the automatic administrative share creation via group policy, but this is much a simpler way. In order to disable these shares permanently, IG triggers will be necessary. Now, as I am currently on XP machine, I am going to show you how to disable administrator shares on the workstation machine. So, the procedure for disabling emergency administrator shares on a server machine is also the same. Just a little different at the end is the name of the registry reward value. We will discuss it at ends. Let's start the hack. Click on start one type in the gadgets this will open the windows registry editor we will look for the hive hp local machine and follow to system current control set services and uh, just hit l to go to landman server then parameters and in the right side pane we will look for the auto share wps the word value now set its value to zero well if you cannot find the value in the registry under the exact location please right click on the registry pane of the window and create it a reboot is necessary for this to take effect now, if you are going to disable administrative shares on Windows NT, Windows 2000 or Windows 2003 server, then follow all the above steps which I just shown you until you look at the right side of the auto share WPS. Now, I am going to delete it. So, if you are disabling your administrative shares on Windows server machine, then just look for the auto share server key and set it to set its value to zero well but if you can't find the value in the registry under the exact location please right click and create a dword value name it auto share server and set its value to zero again a reboot is necessary for this to take effect if you want to administrate the shares to be recreated, you can change the value back to 